What's up guys, welcome to a very quick new Final Cut tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to get the perfect slow motion, the perfect percent amount that you need to slow your footage down to get the perfect slow motion. Whether you have 120 FPS, 60 FPS, even just 30 FPS that you want to slow down to maybe 24 if you have like for example drone clips. This method will get you the perfect amount of slow motion each and every time. And apparently not a lot of people know about this trick so let me show you. So here we are in Final Cut. This is just a clip from the latest music video I shot. We shot it in Switzerland in the beautiful nature and we have this waterfall where the water is falling down the mountain. This clip was shot at 120 FPS and right now it's currently replaying at 24 FPS. So click on the clip, go to this little stopwatch icon right here, click on it and then go to custom. And now we don't put in a percent number ourselves, we just click on automatic which will slow down the 120 FPS in our 24 FPS timeline down by 20%. And when we now play it back we can see we have a perfect slow motion. 120 FPS played back in 24 FPS which gives us this perfect buttery smooth slow motion. Let's try it one more time, this time with a 60 FPS clip. This is from my latest restaurant shoot, we just shot these beautiful wines right here. Go to custom again, click on automatic and this time it's slowed down by 40% which is 60 FPS in a 24 FPS timeline played back and we have a subtle slow motion. One last time with a 120 FPS clip from the same restaurant shoot, my colleague wanted to try a Daniel Schiffer style slow motion clip with the different pizza ingredients thrown in the air with some water. Slowed down by 20% and here is the final shot. Now that's already it from this Final Cut quick tip. That's how you get the perfect slow motion in a Final Cut timeline each and every time. I really hope you enjoyed it and you learned something new and it was helpful. If you did, please be sure to hit that like button and also consider subscribing right here for more videos just like this one. You can find more Final Cut tutorials in the playlist right here and the last Final Cut tutorial right here. And I will hopefully see you in the next video. Goodbye.